Hello Taurus and welcome to your October reading. This is April from 33 and above tarot and I'm here to deliver messages for October. Um, just want to let you know that these messages are general and timeless. Um, if you're interested in booking a reading, the information is in the description box below. All right, so let's get right into it. Oh, and I also wanted to mention to please check your sun, moon, and rising sign, okay? All right, let's go. Ooh, the world card. Wow, wow, wow. So it looks like someone's experiencing a little, uh, some, some success. Someone is feeling um, fulfilled. Someone is being recognized. Um, I also am feeling like someone, I feel like the, it's also like the, the wheels are turning. So like karma. So someone is either receiving good karma or someone is receiving bad. Um, take what resonates. But I'm feeling like it's a good thing. This could be you or someone in your energy. Oh. Too many cards, spirit. Sorry, guys. Too many cards. So what else is going on with Taurus for October? But this looks like... All right, too many cards. All right, let's go. Looks like you are feeling fulfilled, though, so that's a good sign. Um, <laughs> what is going on in this? Okay. Let's, let's do this. Hmm. This is the nine of pentacles in reverse. So this could be a possible, not really such a good um, sort of turnaround. So this looks like this might be a possible loss in money a possible loss in um, motivation. Um, you know, you take what resonates, but it's it's like, you know, you know what karma is like you, when you put out good karma, you receive good karma. If you put out bad karma, you receive bad karma. Now, I'm not saying that you're receiving bad karma if this is your energy, but you are feeling like there's some sort of misfortune or loss. Or you're a little, you feel a little, maybe you're feeling anxiety from a situation. Um, you feel like maybe karma is going to come around and um, not be so positive for you. Or you're, you're cautious about something. So let's see. What is that? You are cautious about something, Pisces. And maybe it's for good reason, you know. Let's check it out. So this is five of swords. So you're cautious about uh, either you, you feel like you won, but it was like an actual loss, it seems like. So it was a situation where, you know, something happened and it was like, you know, those situations where you feel like you got the last word, and but you still wanted to get still argue you like it wasn't like you wanted the last word as if you wanted the conversation to end but you got the last word and you it was like a short-lived victory but then there was some sort of emptiness afterwards so that's what i'm feeling from this energy this could be you or this could be the person in your energy but there's definitely some sort of loss Either money, it could be attention, it could be um, friendship, relationship, some sort of abundance is definitely significant. So if someone wasn't treating you right and if they're still on your mind, most likely there's, you know, you're on their mind too, but and maybe you felt like, you know, you didn't get the last word or you felt like, you know, they just didn't give you the time to speak or say your piece. There was no closure or, you know, so both 
I feel like maybe both parties feel like, I, you know, I, I feel like maybe the one party is feeling like they're moving on to a new direction and the other party is looking back at the situation and it's like, hmm, maybe I shouldn't have done that. This wasn't what I thought it, I was going to feel when I got this victory, you know? So let's get one another card. Let's get another. Oops, sorry about that. Let's get another card. Oh, too many cards. One. Yep, someone definitely felt a loss. Definitely. Someone lost their queen. <laughs> or someone lost a lot of money. Or a lot of um like a lot of trust. Someone lost a lot of trust. Someone feels neglected from the situation. And it may be because of their own doing. They may have caused this on their own. But some, someone is definitely feeling this loss. And someone is walking away too. You see here, you see that person in the background? Let's see if I can focus. Focus right there. See that person? In the background it's like you know what i'm gonna be all right and then this other person is like smiling but looking back and there's like envy jealousy you know passion though just a lot of air to um could be dealing with a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. Or you could be dealing with an Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Which is you. <laughs> Sorry, I just need to focus. So you could be dealing with another Taurus. But, yeah, someone definitely is experiencing a loss and someone's starting their new beginning. That's what I feel like. Because you see this card here. She is just, or he, she could just, you know, choose the energies. It's like, yes. Yes. I'm free. I am free. And they're floating. Yeah. That's what I'm feeling. So let's get an advice card here. Taurus, what's the advice card for Taurus here? No need to stress over closed doors when you already have the key. No need to stress over closed doors when you already have the key. And Taurus, you are about security, so you have the key. <laughs> you don't need to ask for anyone for a key because you have it. <laughs> you are the secure one, you know? You are the one that would have the house. <laughs> You're the one that would have the keys to the house or keys to the car. <laughs> so, you know, it's just basically saying be secure in who you are regardless of the situation. So if you're the person that is experiencing the loss, and felt like maybe you made a mistake, you know, try to rectify it. If you feel like um, defeated about a situation, tune within. But know that, you know, there's lessons in all of these things. And it's up to you whether or not you want to take and learn and apply. So, all right, Taurus, that was your October reading. I hope this, these messages resonated with you. If they did, please hit the like button. Please comment and subscribe. And I hope you have a wonderful October, all right? Thank you so, so, so much. And have a great day. All right, bye.